Welcome to another episode of Urbex Atlanta. We are up to 98 episodes. And we're covering a temporary close, Red Lobster. And by temporary, it's permanently closed. Because they are auctioning off all the equipment for this one out in Roswell. See if there's any little things. This location's closed. Marked as temporary closed on their website. Uh, is there anyone inside? Doubt. So yeah, this one closed a couple days ago. And there's about 80 locations across the U.S. So my heart goes out to all those people that have lost their jobs. Now everything's up for auction at all those locations. It's just a horrible thing for to happen to those people just because Virtually all the employees had no clue that their stores were closing. Been seeing it in restaurant worker groups all damn week. And uh, another sign for saying we're closed. You can smell the grease really strong. The lights are on. And I wonder how much uh, this stuff's gonna go for once the auction finishes up. Sorry if my walking's a little off or slow. I am recovering from some injections I had earlier this week. Finally getting out and about. And all ceiling tiles, Christmas decorations, concrete? What the hell? I can smell the fryer oil really well. What else did I get rid of? Whole bunch of stuff. Old bus pans. And stuff for the computers. Signage. Not surprised that uh, saw that stuff thrown away. Probably for oh, all the branded stuff. Do not overfill. Is there anything in here? There is stuff. I cannot see it since my camera's way up over that way. <laughs> I'll let you all take a guess. I might try to swing back here on Friday, but more than likely no. Again, it's a real shame. Can I see inside? No, it won't let me. But dear gods, I could smell that old fryer oil and it smells gnarly as hell. So, that's that. We'll see what happens with this location after everything gets sold off. If another fish place comes in, or something else entirely. Or if it just stays the rot, I'll find out eventually. And Thank y'all for staying with me on this video. Be sure to hit up the Patreon if you haven't. And if you've ever eaten at Red Lobster, tell me what you've eaten. Because I never have.
I don't think I ever will if it goes like this. Shoot. But I will see y'all next time on another episode of Remix Atlanta. Peace.